टूडे आई एल टक अबाउट लैमिनार भिस्कोमेट्रिक फ्लो विटुईन कोअक्सियल सिलिंडार्स हेयर इज द प्रब्लेम स्टेटमेंट ए भिस्कस लिकुईड फिल्स द एनुअर गैप विटुईन भार्टिकल कन्सेंट्रिक सिलिंडार द इनार सिलिंडार इज स्टेशनारी दैट इज द इनार सिलिंडार एंड द आउटार सिलिंडार रोटेट्स एट कन्सटैंट स्पीड ओमेगा हेयर दिस आउटार सिलिंडार इज रोटेट्स एट कन्सटैंट स्पीड The flow is laminar. Now simplify the continuity Navier-Stokes and tangential shear stress equation to model this flow field. So here simplify the continuous continuity Navier-Stokes and tangential shear stress equation to model this flow field, and obtain the expression for the liquid velocity profile and shear stress distribution. So now we have to obtain liquid. Velocity profile and shear stress distribution. Now, first we have to write the continuity equation means governing equation and Navier-Stokes equation. So here, this is the continuity equation: one by r dou by dou r, r v r plus one by r dou v theta by dou theta plus dou v z by dou z is equal to zero. Navier-Stokes equation, then radial component means r component is rho dou v r dou t plus v r dou v r dou By dou r plus v theta by r dou v r dou theta minus v theta square by r plus v z dou v r by dou z is equal to rho g r minus dou p dou r plus mu. Then dou square v r dou r square plus one by r dou v r dou r plus one by r square dou square r v r dou theta square minus two by r square dou v theta dou theta plus dou square v r dou z square. Similarly for theta direction. And z direction. So now we have to simplify continuity equation and Navier-Stokes equation. So now here is the assumption. First one is steady flow. So an angular speed of outer cylinder is constant. So one is steady flow, and angular speed of the outer cylinder is constant. And the second assumption is incompressible flow means rho is constant. And third, third is No flow or variation of properties in z direction means v z is equal to zero and dou by dou z of something is equal to zero and circumferentially symmetric flow so properties don't do not vary with theta so dou by dou theta of something is equal to zero so assumption one eliminates the time variation in the fluid properties and assumption two eliminates the pace variation in density and assumption three so no flow variation so Or cause all terms in z component of the Navier-Stokes equation will be vanish, so except except for the hydrostatic pressure distribution, and uh, so from here, so this is the continuity equation. So v theta, dou v theta, dou v theta means dou by dou theta x something is zero, so this term will be zero, and dou by dou z dou z of something is equal to zero, so that will be zero. So one by r dou by dou r r v r is equal to Zero. So from here, do by do r r v r is equal to zero. Now I am going to simplify the Navier-Stokes equation. So this term is zero as a steady state. This term is zero steady state. This term is zero. There is a no variation in z direction, so that is zero. So here as v z is zero, so all terms are Zero. Okay, and uh, this all are zero, and here that uh, from Navier-Stokes equation, so we got that d by d r r v r is zero, so uh, that is zero, right? So now here uh, from here we can get that v theta is actually function of r. Now, as v theta is a function of r, so this term will be there, and this term will be there. And as v theta is zero, so this term will be zero, and v dou by dou theta is zero, so this term will be zero. Now, because gravity, uh, that g r and g theta actually zero. Now, gravity only act in g z direction, that is minus g, that direction. So now this is zero. Now here, dou by dou z is equal to zero, and here that v theta dou v r dou by dou theta that is zero, and here 
rho by rho r v r that is 0 from that continuity equation. So that is also 0, that is also 0, that is also 0, that is also 0. Now here that rho by rho theta is actually 0. Now here that rho by rho z is actually 0, v theta is 0, now here v theta is also 0, this is also 0. So only we have this term and from here we have this term and this term. So we can change the color, we can change the color. So this term will be there, this term will be there and here this term will be there. Okay, and this term will be there. So from here, so we will get that radial component from this radial direction we will get minus rho v theta square by r is equal to minus rho p by rho r and azimuthal component 0 is equal to mu rho by rho r 1 by r rho by rho r r v theta. So that is actually 0. Now actually we are getting from uh, we are getting this from here. So now from here mu is 0 so we will get rho by rho r 1 by r rho by rho r r v theta is equal to 0. So from here if we do that integrate uh, if we integrate once we will get 1 by r rho by rho r r v theta is equal to c1 and again if I do the integration so here r v theta is equal to c1 r square by 2 and c2. Now v theta is nothing but c1 r by 2 plus c2 r. So now we got this equation solution. Now we have to calculate C1 and C2. For that we have to apply boundary condition because that outer cylinder is rotating and inner cylinder is constant. Okay. So now here that at R is equal to R2 means outer cylinder radius that is V theta uh, outer cylinder is rotating so V theta is omega R2 and at R is equal to R1 so V theta is 0 because inner cylinder is 0. So now you plug that so from here that v theta is equal to so v theta is equal to here that c1 r c1 r by 2 plus c2 here c2 by r c2 by r okay so here uh, okay so v theta okay, c2 by r now here uh, we plug this boundary condition so at r is equal to capital r2 then v theta will be the omega r2 so omega r2 c1 into r2 by 2 plus c2 r2 and at r is equal to r1 r is equal to r1 v theta is 0 so v theta is 0 c1 r1 by 2 plus c2 r1 so now from here if we solve these two equation we will get c1 and c2 now i am going to solve that so c1 so here c2 is nothing but minus c1 by c1 r1 square by 2 now the omega r2 is uh, we have plug that c2 value uh, here c2 value uh, in this equation so now we will get that omega r2 is equal to c1 r2 by 2 minus c1 r1 square by 2 r2 from if we do that simplification so c1 is nothing but 2 omega r2 square by r2 square minus r1 square and c2 will be now plug uh, that c1 here so c2 will be minus omega r1 square by r2 square by r2 square minus r1 square. Now if I plug this original equation, so we will get the velocity profile. So here v theta is c1 by r by 2 plus c2 by r. Now we plug this c1 and c2 value and then we reorganize and uh, if we simplify, we will get v theta r that v theta is function of r. So that is omega r2 square r2 square minus r1 square r minus r1 square by 2. So this is velocity profile. Now next uh, we got that v theta r is equal to omega r2 square r, r, r by r2 square minus r1 square into r minus r1 square by 2. Now we know that shear stress formula is this now but rho by rho theta is 0. So this is 0. So ultimately mu r rho by rho r then v theta r by r. Now we know v theta um, r is this. So if we plug, uh, so now here, so we are plugging this uh, v theta and by r. Now we will simplify this. So now v theta by r is nothing but this one. Now if we do the differentiation, we will get omega r2 square by r2 square. So this is actually constant. 
okay now we have to do that uh, the differentiation of this if we do the differentiation that will be 2 r1 square by r3 now if we plug this so d by dr uh, is nothing but dr d by dr v theta uh, of r by r is nothing but omega r2 square by r2 square minus r1 square into 2 r1 square by r3 now if we plug this mu dot uh, so this is the original formula so r dou by dou r of this so now plug this so if we plug we will get that mu r dot 2 omega r1 square by r2 square r3 r2 square minus r1 square so now here this r and this r one r will be cancelled out so ultimately r tau r theta is nothing but 2 mu omega r1 square r2 square r square uh, small r square by r2 capital r2 square minus r1 square so this is the shear stress distribution so we got that same uh, we got the velocity profile and shear stress distribution also it did that uh, simplification of um, continuity equation and nebista equation and then we solve we got that velocity profile and shear stress distribution that's it thank you